Hello, it's Omega again. Uh, today I'm doing a Walmart haul and I have a decent amount of things so I'm not going to sit down and show everything and then do the try on. And I'll do my best to link everything that I can link down below. I know that some things aren't available on the site, they're only available in store. So if there's no link, I couldn't find one. Uh, the first item is this lovely little spring dress here. It's just a little swing dress. It doesn't go in or you know follow your curves or anything like that but it does have pockets and it is a decent length it's just just above the knee uh, I bought it in a small and it's good under the armpits which is nice a lot of times um, the no bound or not no boundaries the the time and true stuff I have to have an extra small or else it's super big on me <laughs> but in this this small works perfectly and the other item that I have on that's from Walmart are these lovely shoes. Uh, I'm going to do the shoes a little bit later, uh, but I wanted to show them. These are the awesome little snake print, snake print uh, slip-ons. And this dress was $9.96, which is an insanely good price for this wonderful fabric. This color is beautiful, and let's see. 95% rayon, 5% spandex. This is one of my favorite fabrics on the planet. And the price is ridiculously good. It does come in other colors. Um, it did not have anything but this and a striped one that I did not like. Um, some kind of, hey, ah, 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 nope. Nope, 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 nope. There you go. Take it out there. And a lot of stripes I don't particularly care for. Oh my goodness. I'll be right back. The dog is having a noisy play mode. Okay. And then I did grab a couple items that are accessories. And first, I took this out of the plastic so that I can show you without that hideous glare back. So I'll go ahead and tell you the price now. These are $4.88. And it's this lovely little set that has silver, yellow gold, and rose gold. And it has just these little itty bitty studs and then these little dangly rectangles, and then larger um, circles here uh, in each color. And I like that because I do have three holes, and generally I'll wear a dangly in the front, and then I want little studs for the back two. And so I think that this set will suffice nicely. Another thing that I do, and these are $4.88 for this whole kit and caboodle, is smaller hoops in the upper and then larger in the front. And these also have rose gold here and then some silver and then like some gunmetal. And these ones are really cool, a little gunmetal color. And then gold down here. And it was $4.88 for all of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pairs. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine pairs. So that's pretty good. And then this one is $6.88 for a collection of chains. And down here, it tells you each length, and they're all different, so they are all stackable in this fashion. And what I, what I really got this for is this black one right here. I have been looking for a black necklace, and ta-da! There we have one, and we also have the larger chains, which are all in right now. So there's that. And then I got this lovely accessory. Ha, ha, ha. We'll call it accessory. It's a purse. And, you know, their purses are normally very good prices, but this one was on clearance. So I got this bad boy for $4. It has this little front pocket here that has the magnetic snap. And then it has a um, zipper here. And inside of that, here, let me toss this stuff out of the way. It's a big open area that looks like it will hold a darn decent amount because if you look here this width is kind of nice and so i could wear this with black or i can wear it with tan or i can wear it with anything i want and call it a neutral um, and for four dollars i'm very happy with that so next i will move on to some of the other clothes Besides this lovely thing that is just going to get so much use this summer. I'm so happy. I'm going to have to hunt down a couple of the other solid colors. Um, 
in the size small. They only had it in um, the pink. They have this beautiful soft baby pink and uh, they only had it in a large and an extra large, I think. And then um, there was another color that I liked that was a medium and a large or something like that. And they just were, were gonna be way too big. So I may have to hunt those down either at another Walmart or online. Be right back. We have the next couple of things. This top is actually a uh, No Boundaries top, which is the Junior's line. So I got it in um, a size small instead of the extra small that I usually get in the um, time, uh, time and True. Yeah, Time and True line. And it's okay. It, you know, if I yank back, I get a little bit of pullage, but I don't really ever do that. Um, it has the little tie in the back, and it has the little button sleeves here, and it does the peplum thing. It's sort of baby doll and sort of umpire waist. I don't know. Um, eh. I'm kind of torn on this. I know that it's marked $12.96, but I got it on clearance. I think it was $4. So for $4, I mean, why not? goes lower in the back and I am wearing a pair of the time and true slip-on white tennies which are psychotically comfortable I have quite a few different pairs of them and I also have some pairs of what are supposed to be like running shoes from Skechers that are supposed to give you ultimate art support super comfort blah 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 I've worn these Walmart shoes on eight hour shifts and my feet hurt less than they do when I wear the super comfortable yada yada shoes from Skechers for a six hour shift. So if you're looking for comfort, just go get some from Walmart. They're far cheaper and they totally work. Now let's talk about these shorts. These are time and true shorts. I believe they're $13.44, something like that. And I got these in the size four because I like a little bit more room in the thigh. And as you can see, I really don't have much. <laughs> and getting that room in the thigh made this happen. Um, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do on these. Uh, I love the color. I love the, the button fly, I think that's great. And it has this built-in creasing instead of whiskering and the pockets do work and they aren't super deep but they're deeper than a lot of the fake pockets around and then the pockets in the back are real um it is a four inch inseam and it has the the raw hem but it's sewn so it's not gonna fray up anymore and turn into craziness i don't dislike these um but I'm also not in love with them. Uh, I may keep them because of the color, but I don't think that I'll go back and get um, the other colors. I will look for a different pair for being my solid denim, denim shorts. But the length is kind of nice. I, I like that. That's not too short and that's not too long. When it starts getting down here and it's basically Bermuda's, you know. I have, I think, one pair of jean bermudas that come to like there but generally if i'm going to do a bermuda it's going to be a dress bermuda where it, you know it's like short slacks basically <laughs> and at that length you might as well just go to a capri frankly so that's these two and we will move on to the next okay this is going to be funny but this is the only way i can think of to show it this is a bodysuit and it's a no boundaries bodysuit and because that small was in the um no boundaries shirt was kind of snuggish I decided I should try a medium in the bodysuit right yeah no um, it doesn't even snug up to my back this here is like super super loose this back here is super loose uh, everything about this is just too big so I'd have to take it back and get a small but part of the reason that I got a medium is that my torso and bodysuits and stuff don't seem to get along and this like wants to go to war with my kuka so i figured i'd try it medium but then it just totally defeats the purpose of a bodysuit which is to have it 
be a second skin. And this just totally is not. I have to grab a whole bunch of fabric here to make it snug up. And then down here, it's still wrinkling and being stupid. So this is definitely going back. Um, I'm gonna put on a tank top and then we'll talk about these leggings that I basically just got to wear under a dress or two that I have um, that are kind of short. <laughs> Be right back. We are back with these, my little staples that I get every few years. These are the Time and True Extra Small Adjustable Strap Camis and uh, I try to grab them when I see them in new colors or in a color that I have completely torn through. Because I use these for layering and sometimes in the summer with just shorts. And they are uh, $3.48 each and they are a, a decent material. Let's see, 55% cotton, 37% modal, and 8% spandex. And uh, so I got this color and I got this color, a nice dark tan because the quote flesh tones look kind of off-whitey on me a lot of times, especially when I get a tan in the summer, I'm gonna be this. And so this is great for underneath shirts that are a little bit see-through. Now, let's talk about these leggings. Okay, these leggings I got to go under dresses. Um, I have, you know, some little swing dresses that are kind of short, and so these are for that. The problem is, is that they didn't have any extra smalls. They only had smalls, and so I got them saying, eh, whatever, but I have like huge garbage here going on, and so they're not really hanging on at all, and so I have to kind of, you know, tug them up all the time, which is a bummer. I think in the white, honestly, I, I probably will just leave it be and just kind of side seam it myself by hand uh, because then this white part, it doesn't get stretched out and then super see through, which is all of our worst nightmares. So in the white, I think I'll leave it alone, but I also got them in a navy and I have not taken the tags off yet because I tried the white first, figuring if there's one that's going to be too big, then I want it to be the white ones because it's better. Um, so I'm going to take these, these ones back because they're just not the right size. Um, the length is good. I will sneak back. And um, that is a problem that I have is inseam length. I'm generally a, a 32 if it wants to be anything but looking like an ankle length or a capri. So it's nice that they actually are long enough. I appreciate that. And I still have the same little white slides on. So I'm going to go to the uh, last item that I have. And sadly, I think it's a fail. Um, you guys can vote. but. I think that I either need to size down or just give up on it. Be right back. Here is this dress, and I absolutely wanted to love this, but shoulder seams are way down here, <laughs> and it's quite large under here. I mean, that's a lot of cabbage. It does have pockets, and it has these little side slits, which are lovely. Uh, but it's just mm, too big. Uh, and this is why I was very happy that that little green swing dress that's a size small fits so well, because this is a size small, and we see the shoulder issues that are going on. I have seen other people try this dress on, and they said that, you know, like the, the pockets were bulking out and causing them problems. And on me, I don't feel like that's happening. And that could be because it's so big on me um, that it's not being pulled and so the pockets aren't showing or something. I don't know. But this, I, I want the shoulder seams to be up where shoulder seams belong. I don't want to have to worry about the view into my armpit. <laughs> but the color is amazing. And it's this, it's this little bit ribbed fabric. I'll get up close, hopefully you can see. Yeah, there we go. 
See, it's this little ribbed fabric and uh, it's a very nice feeling fabric. Let me see if I can figure out what she is. 57 cotton, 38 poly, five spandex. So, you know, she's a, she's made out of a decent fabric and the color is magnificent. I mean, this is insane. Um, I might just keep it and then I haven't seen an extra small in stores. I haven't looked online to see if they even exist, but I would really, really be bummed if I took it back and turned it in and then couldn't find it again at all <laughs> because they don't make an extra small. I'm, I'm just not sure. It seems like none of my Walmarts around here, there's like three or four of them within seven, eight miles of me and none of them seem to carry extra smalls. It's always small and up and it's very aggravating. Um, I don't want to have to order online. I want to hold it up and see how things land on my shoulders. Um, and I thought I'd give this one a try because it's, you know, a little big, but it just feels a little sloppy. I think it looks okay though. Um, so let me know what you think. I mean, does it look all right or does it look like it's too big? Um, but the, the color's great and I think that I would get a lot of use out of this. I could actually wear this to work work you just have to have it past your knees and this does that and even on the side it's below my knee so I could wear this to work and be nice and secure and comfy so and I could change the belt out you know you can always change your belt out to something else besides what comes with it but I just left this on for now because I'm undecided and let's see this $15 I <laughs> mean it's it's hard to take something back that's so pretty in so many ways when it's only $15 it's hard to say no <laughs> so and then I have on another pair of the uh, time and true snakes and these one are the the black quilted ones and I really enjoyed these as well there's only one more pair of shoes so I think what I'll do is I'll move to my normal um, you know wrap up area and have the shoes and so I can show them to you a little bit better up close, um, which means that I won't be able to show you the other ones on, but whatever, you get the idea, right? And so I'll go ahead and do that and be right back with the shoes. Okay, we're back and I will go ahead and get you a little bit of a closer look at these. These are the time and true and they're six and a half wide. Whenever I can find wide, I get wide. But I have found that Walmart shoes in general do run a little wider. So if I can't get a wide, what I do is I size up to a seven and then it gives me room. And if you check these bad boys out, they have the snake print that also has like a gold foil through them, which makes them a lot of fun and they are ridiculously comfortable. They have the memory foam in there like all Walmart tennis seem to and it is so comfy. So that's that pair and actually this pair, um, I got before I got these other ones, and these were on clearance at the time for, I think it was seven or eight dollars, and I was like, yes! <laughs> and these ones hadn't come out yet. Now you'll have to excuse the scuffing. I've worn these. These have gone to work on my feet several times. And you'll notice, see, not a wide, so I got a seven. But they're perfectly comfortable if I just size up because it moves the wider area back on my foot a little bit but they also have the memory foam on them. And I'll get up close so that you can see it has that little holes all throughout the, the leather that you know don't really actually go through to anything but the fabric that lines the inside, but uh, it gives you the illusion. <laughs> and they are insanely comfortable and they're just slip-ons as well. These, again, a wide width, six and a half wide and you can see the lovely quilting pattern that these have and these are just a slip on again memory foam ridiculously comfortable uh, and all of these shoes um, even at full price none of them are even 20 bucks so yeah for a comfortable pair of shoes for under 20 dollars sign mama up these are a seven because they did not have wide. 
They are just a solid white along the front and then on the back they have this kind of speckled gold. And they also have the memory foam on the inside and they are insanely comfortable. And I have worn them to work multiple times and I love them. Uh, my daughter saw these and immediately wanted a pair and I asked her you know okay so we can go to Walmart and get a pair but do you want to go to Ross and look first and we ended up going to um, Ross and she found a pair of um, oh gosh what were they not Adidas something else some other name brand pair that were on clearance at Ross for like $16 so about the same price as these but name brand and she fell in love with them and they were the cat's meow so she has those and I have these and now she won't <laughs> think my shoes are hers that has happened before we went to the beach for um, her uh, her father's ashes send-off and she was wearing a pair of black tennis shoes I knew that she was in my pants I knew that she was in my shirt because she didn't have anything black and she was wearing black tennis and I thought they were hers no come to find out after she trotted into the waves <laughs> and got wet sand all over in the shoes. They were size seven, they were mine. <laughs> Her size six were here at the house. So it's nice for them to be different than hers so that mine don't get stolen and trashed and then, oops, sorry. So that's good. So that's my little Walmart haul. Um, I think there are some definite winners and then there were a couple, eh, um, I'm not sure about the pink shirts, uh, the pink shorts. Um, I'm going to take back the blue leggings and I'm just not sure about this. Um, let me know what you think. I mean, it is a, it, it is big, but does it look bad big or does it just look comfy big? So if you could let me know, that would be great. Thank you so much. And we will talk to you later.